Whether you're new to plumbing or just generally curious about the heating system in your home, you may well have seen controls that look something like this or this. These components are called zone valves and they come in a variety of shapes and sizes, but generally zone valves tend to look like a small box on the pipework with a cable coming from it and also sitting on top of a brass fitting. Most valves come in two parts, the body or the brass fitting and the actuator or the motorised control part of the valve. Zone valves are also called two port valves because they have two openings, one at either end of the valve. A zone valve then is simply a valve which is allowed to open or close to control the flow of water within the pipework. It works through the use of a synchronous motor which is a small geared motor that opens or closes the mechanism inside the brass section of the valve. In this example two zone valves are installed. One zone valve is on a pipe which leads to the heating for the downstairs part of the building and the other valve is on the pipe that leads to the upstairs part of the building. By sending an electrical charge to either one of the valves or even both at the same time the valves can be opened to allow water to circulate through the corresponding circuit. To allow the water to flow and to stop it flowing again there's usually a paddle or a ball inside the brass section of the valve which moves away from its seating when the motor is energised and it allows water to flow. Or it rests against its seating when the motor is de-energised which then covers the orifice and prevents water from flowing. You could even say that it's like a light switch for water. That concludes this very basic explanation of what a zone valve is and what a zone valve does. If you're still curious and you want to go a little bit further, then look out for my next video where I'll be explaining in greater detail how the zone valve operates as part of a heating and hot water system, as well as how they are most commonly wired for best effect. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed watching. Please leave a comment or even subscribe to help the channel grow, and I shall see you in the next video.